how to install Xiaomi EU MIUI 12.5.1 stable based on Android 10 from the Xiaomi Mi 8 on the Xiaomi Poco F1. Hey peeps, what's up? Manchi here, back with another video and in this video I'm going to show you how you can install Xiaomi EU MIUI 12.5.1 stable based on Android 10 from the Xiaomi Mi 8 on the Xiaomi Poco F1. Now, what are the prerequisites for this video? Well, for starters, you need to have an unlocked bootloader. Then you need to have TWRP recovery installed. How do you unlock the bootloader? How do you install TWRP? Videos for those can be found in the description of the video. Next thing, make sure your battery is charged at least 50 to 60%. Do not do this process if your battery is at 20 or 30%. Another prerequisite is that make sure you are coming from stock MIUI because there have been instances wherein people are coming from custom ROMs and the ROM is not booting. Next up, if your device is not encrypted, that means you will have to perform a format data. So how do you find out whether your device is encrypted or not? If you are on MIUI, you can go into settings, password and security, and then if you go into privacy, here it is, encryption and credentials says phone not encrypted. Now do note, this is an enforcing build and safety net does pass out of the box. Another question which I will get is, does it have IR face unlock? So yes, it does have IR face unlock and that works without any issues. Play Store, etc. are installed out of the box. Keyword for the assistant lady also works without any issues. So here we are on stock MIUI 12.0.3.0 based on Android 10 and as I mentioned earlier in the video make sure you are coming from stock MIUI because there have been instances wherein people are coming from custom ROMs and the device is not booting or going into a boot loop. The next thing we can do is we can go into password and security and then if you go into privacy you will notice that the phone is not encrypted. If your phone is encrypted you will have to perform a format data in which case you are going to lose all your pictures, videos and anything important which you have on your device. Next up let us go back into password and security, remove your screen lock, fingerprint and face unlock. Once that is done go back, go into me account and remove your me account. Once that is done go back, go into accounts and sync and remove your google account once you've removed all the accounts and security measures make sure you reboot your device once now why are we removing all the accounts and security measures we are doing this because we are going from one rom to another and i don't want you to be locked out of your own device next up what are the files which you need now all the files which you need are linked in the description of the video so for starters you need the rom itself so this is xiaomi eu 12.5.1 stable a port from the xiaomi mi 8 then you also need the firmware file now before you ask me why are we flashing the firmware file one more time we're just being safe if you want to take the risk of skipping it feel free to do so then you also need genos kernel now once you have all the files next thing you need to boot into twrp so for that the first thing we are going to do is we are going to turn off our device and once the device has turned off press and hold volume up and power button at the same time till you see the recovery logo so here it is we are booting into team win or twrp recovery and here is the version of twrp recovery which i am using and of course this is linked in the description of the video now a bunch of you will ask me what if i want to use some other recovery be my guest feel free to do so I cannot guarantee it's going to boot because it is not possible for me to try out each and every recovery. Next up, go into wipe, advanced wipe, select Dalvik, cache, system, vendor and data and then swipe to wipe. Once the wipe process has finished successfully, tap on the home button, go into install. Now you need to select the folder where you have all the files. In case you downloaded the files on your phone directly, they will be in the download folder. For me, I have transferred them to the DCIM folder. First First up select the firmware file, add more zips, then select the ROM file itself. This is again Xiaomi EU and then add more zips, select the Genos kernel and then swipe to confirm flash. Now once all the files have flashed successfully, let us scroll up, make sure there were no errors. So here it is, we are flashing the firmware file 
and if you scroll down there were no errors in this case script succeeded result was one next up we are flashing the rom itself xiaomi eu 12.5.1 xiaomi mi 8 port again no errors here as well script succeeded result was one and then you are flashing genos kernel no errors here as well next tap on the home button those of you whose device was encrypted you need to perform a format data go into wipe format data type in yes and then tap on the check mark on the bottom right as i mentioned earlier format data will result in wiping out of all your pictures videos and anything important which you have on your device those of you who were decrypted you might ask me do we need to flash disable force encryption the answer for that is no so again my device was not encrypted we can skip the format data part go into reboot and select system and there it is we do have the miui 12.5 boot animation on our poco f1 now an important thing to note over here is that the first boot up will take anywhere between four to five minutes so you do have to be patient and there it is we do have the miui 12.5 boot up screen let me skip the initial setup real quick so there it is we are on the home screen let me increase the brightness a little bit so that it is easier on the eyes let us go into settings my device here it is xiaomi eu 12.5.1 stable go into all specs android version of course is 10 security patches from december 2020 and you can blame xiaomi for that the kernel of course is genos kernel next up let me connect to the wi-fi so that i can install the Magisk APK and also sign into the Play Store so that we can check for safety net. So here we are, we have connected to the internet, signed into the Play Store, still running EU 12.5.1 stable. Let us go into the Google Play Store and then we can also go into the settings about phone. Here it is Play Protect certification device is certified. This means you should be able to use your banking apps without any issues. Let me also go ahead and install Magisk so that we can check for safety net. So let's go ahead and install install magisk so magisk has installed successfully let us open it do note that installing the magisk apk does not mean you have rooted your device i just use this to check for safety net as you can see magisk is not applicable the app is 23.0 let us check for safety net to see if it is passing or not and as you can see safety net is passing out of the box next up let me go back into twrp root my device install terminal emulator and then we can also check the status of se linux so i'll be back in a few so here we are we are still running the same build 12.5.1 stable xiaomi eu i have of course installed magisk version 23.0 which means the device is rooted and i can check for se linux so let me go ahead open a terminal emulator application try to give it super user access and once that is done we can check for se linux by typing in get enforce and there it is you can see i typed in get enforce se linux is set as enforcing and there it is peeps that is how you install xiaomi eu miui 12.5.1 stable xiaomi mi 8 port on the poco f1 with se linux as enforcing and safety net passing out of the box and that will do it for this video hope my video helped you likes shares and subscribes are appreciated feedback and comment more than welcome see you when i see you